Hey there, so are you having problem receiving notifications on your lock screen on Instagram on iPhone? If yes, don't worry, because today I will show you guys how you can solve their notification is not getting or not being able to see it from the lock screen on iPhone. Now, if you want to solve the problem, the very first work that you really, really want to take a look at is you just got to head over to the settings on your iPhone there. And now you have to head over to your notifications. And once you come over here, you get a scroll all the way down to your Instagram there. And first, make sure you're actually selecting the lock screen on from the LR. So make sure to enable this option. You have to scroll down here and tap show preview and make sure to select always. So if you set to never, then you might receive a notification, but you won't be able to read it. So make sure to set always there. And now you have to just go back, open Instagram there and tap profile, tap three dot line, and you have to select the notification here. So make sure to enable push all notification from there. So you can put it eight hour, for example, and tap post stories and comments. You can simply open that. So if you want to receive notification for post stories and comments, you have to enable all of that from here. Make sure to set everyone. However, if you're not being able to receive the message notification, they have to scroll down and select a message there. And also, like I already have set on, on, on for uh, messages. And there's a one more thing that most people do mistake about, like if you enable the low power mode on your iPhone, then you might not receive a notification. So if you come to your battery there, so if you see the battery on um, the low power mode is enabled, then I highly recommend you guys to disable the low power mode. At the very same time, you want to go back, scroll up and open up the screen time there make sure to disable the screen time on your phone so if you in case enable the screen time disable like a sometime this option also makes the problem so now get out of here and lastly all i want you guys to do is just simply um, open up the app store so let me open up my app store on my iphone there so let's just go and type instagram so let me type instagram and so if you found a new update just like me just go ahead and update the instagram app well after that if you still have problem lastly you have to head over to the settings go to the general and open up the iphone storage from this segment you have to find out the app just open up the instagram tap offload and tap offload again and then tap raise the app and after that raise to your iphone and try to just see what your problem is solved or not so after following all of that process I can tell you your problem is going to be solved. And still, if you guys have anything to ask, please let me know in the comment section, guys. See you all around.